Rob Vargas. Josh Strangle. So, new money. Yeah. A bunch of stories about the rising class of hustlers was, I believe, the line we threw <laughs> out there because we couldn't quite figure out how to talk about all these people. Yeah. Pretty simple concept. Yeah. It's um, money with kind of douchey looking millennials on it. It's amazing how quickly <laughs> you can get to what you need on a cover. I don't want to say the avarice of our subjects, but the uh, focus on money made it very clear that there's a certain element of solipsism that lent itself to literal new money. Right. So, how'd you do it? So we had three iterations of this cover. Um, one was a $100 bill um, with this bearded guy wearing sunglasses. The other one was a 500 uh, euro note with this uh, girl kind of putting up some like weird cheesy signs. The third one was a 100 uh, yuan note with this guy on an iPad. He has large headphones on. And so we thought these were kind of like funny and a silly way to get at the story. And we obviously also, you know, distributed the Euro one in Europe and um, the Yuan in Asia, and so we thought that was a nice way to, to beat it up. Jackie Kessler uh, designed a typography in this nice bright colors, and we thought it was pretty nice. There are amazing stories in this package. Chris Beam has a great story, in particular, on the rising class of second-generation wealth in China and their unbelievable capacity to spend it, uh, which is really an amazing piece. I would point people to the opening remarks this week, written by Paul Barrett, about the John Roberts court. Um, which has, you know, largely been touted as leaning left as a result of the ACA decision in June. But Paul says, no, that is not the case. You know what? I think it's a great magazine, Rob. <laughs> you do. I do. And I think because it's a great magazine, it's probably my time to go. Wow, well, that's, that's very sad. Yes, um, we buried the lead. Uh, this is my last issue of Business Week. It's been six years. It's been an unbelievable ride. I'm going to miss everybody. I'm going to miss the hell out of you. Same here. You're going to take my calls? Oh, yeah. Really? If, I mean, it, it gets pretty busy here. <laughs> so, you know, I'll, I'll try to... I know, and I'm sure that you'll read my emails with the same celerity that you do now. <laughs> um, no, this has been great. This has yeah. been a, an unbelievable experience. Um, I don't really have more to say than that. Um, one thing I want to know, so what are you going to do on your first day off for six years? Um, I'm going to take my daughter to school. Yeah. I haven't been to a movie during the week in a long time, so maybe I'll try that. Yeah. And by Tuesday morning, I'll probably be sitting outside in the courtyard hoping somebody lets me back in. <laughs> I don't doubt that. That's it, guys. It's a wrap.